Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Starting in PowerPoint 2010, the new File tab within the ribbon replaces the functionality of the older Microsoft Office button that appeared in PowerPoint 2007, or the File menu in versions of PowerPoint prior to 2007. Basically, you can click the File tab in the ribbon to open a view of the file called the Backstage View. In this view, you can perform all of your file management. This includes performing functions such as saving your file, opening an existing file, or creating a new file. The File tab is a new feature that spans all of the applications within Microsoft Office 2010. Within each program, like PowerPoint, the File tab is shown in a different color so that you can easily locate it. When you click the File tab within the ribbon, you will no longer see the contents of the file that you are working on, but rather you will see the backstage view of your file. The commands that are shown at the left side of the view are the file management commands that are available for your program. These include Save, Save As, Open, Close, Info, Recent, New, Print, Save and Send, Help, Options, and Exit in Microsoft PowerPoint 2010. When you click on a command in the section of commands from Info to Help, you will then see additional options for the selected command appear to the right within the Backstage view. You can then make additional selections in the new section as needed. For example, in order to create a new presentation, you would click the New command, and then select the desired presentation template to use from the listing shown at the right side of the Backstage view. You also have access to your basic file management commands, such as Save, Save As, Open, and Close. Selecting these commands will still return you to your presentation and open any additional dialog boxes that may be required, as is the case when selecting the Open or Save As commands. You can also click the Options command in the File tab to open the default options for PowerPoint, just as you could by using the Microsoft Office button in 2007. You can also manage any add-ins for the program within the Options as well. In the File tab is also where you will find the Exit command, which exits the PowerPoint program. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.